check one two one two my check one two one two yep what's going on everybody welcome back to my channel scotty guy games we back with another one y'all of control you know what I mean? last time we left off we walked into this uh federal bureau of control at at bc find out we we become the new director of this fbc and what we find out that that uh there's been some let's see ambiance in this bureau as something possessing over the uh over the people inside the bureau so what we're trying to do is regain control get it control regain control over the uh the bureau as the new director and um yeah, I'm just going to leave it at that. But uh, make sure, you, before we get into this gameplay, make sure you like this, like the video, subscribe if you're new, and we're going to get right into it, bro. Control. Shit, I didn't know that. You got mods too? How do we search away? Hope has asked us to document the his the incantation, she calls it. This is a second affairs. Director's office. Thank you. 
custodian? The part the custodian was doing at the hotline security log. Who was Carl Bishop? I see Bill Everett. Who was Carl Bishop? figure out where to go. Can you hear that? Someone sounds it. like it's coming from the elevator. Where's it coming from? I'll go look. Hi, Jesse. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. It's coming from the elevator. Where's the elevator? I heard that this attack at power power brings up a lot of new questions. Okay. Time to world. Meet me in the domain the Nanos. Who the hell is that? Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. I don't know about a friendly face, but he... He's suspicious, though. The maintenance sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? I don't know, but something about it is just, it's not feeling right. Oh, so I don't got access. It's a long way. The directorial override is right there, in the control room. How do we get there? I don't know, but I don't like these niggas right here. Be a lot.
zero right here. What's down that way? and shit now. Let's see the hiss keep up with it now. Like she... She got that shit on her, bro. I can barely see it, back then.
What the hell is this? Three house old. This old. Oh. singing but by the way but the black pyramid the aero astral plane that's the place we've been in majority of the time I'm um, trying to figure out our our abilities and shit like that Sing it loud as hell. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yip be Sadhana. It happened in the last drop. I draw the need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted. Otherwise, I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy be easy. It's just around the corner. But first... We need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Ah, uh, yeah, hi, ah, uh, you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. The fact one, they've already messed up the in German? Pumps, and the power generators of a power plant, Berkele, and the pensioner inside. He started to feel the band around his head tight. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappeared like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. But don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the trip before I go to my vacation. The works on the task board here. You can do later. And you have time. Vacation? Right. Yes, Owen's gonna cancel my holiday or she's gonna rattle. But don't worry 
Seattle, you'll take care of it and soon this crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. What happens again if that thing blows up? solution in the end. Contain the situation. Northmore never liked me, but he went along with it, to his credit. He didn't really have a choice. I suppose at the end of the day, a director's most basic duty is to keep the lights on. Here's to you, Northmore. There were no prime candidates waiting in the wings, but I was there. Had been the whole time, keeping my head down, working my ass off. I had nothing to lose. I picked up the gun almost on a dare. Oh, okay. Clearly, she, he didn't want the job, same, same thing as Jesse. Pretty ironic. Like he said that, because Jesse was just it, just here to just do the general job, but she ended up going into the director's, into the director's job by picking up that gun. <clears throat> it seems like every, when somebody's trying to pick up that gun, they become director of the director of the, uh, the bureau. Interesting. He's just 
course I need a spot right here. HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just. Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but. Whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing. <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. The Dr. Darling seemed to know we'll be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. Smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen, I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling it? Well, that's catchy. Oh, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. I Try to stay see. alive. That's the only person you rely on. I would too. We need those pumps and converters online? No. No. I just wanted to make sure.
of course. We need to fix this thing ASAP. Enemy the Glock is blocking the pipes. You need to deal with them. He is very clever. He's trying to sneak in. We caught him caught with his hand in the fist.
nasty. That is disgusting, bro. Just hold together a little longer.
F. When the converters and coolant pumps are working again, we should be able to get this baby back down to a safe temperature. I hope. What do you know about the hiss? Not much. Only what I've seen. Well, they use the same tactics that Marshall and Salvador taught us, which makes me think that the hiss haven't completely erased the people inside, which is a pretty fucking horrible thought. Or they're just using whatever they find in their victims' heads. In any case, they are really eager to get inside the power plant. Why do you think that is? Shit, I don't know. They want to make my life harder? What do you know about the service weapon? Not much. I think it's director only. Salvador told me about the time he saw Trench use it. Sounds like that gun can do some serious damage. Yeah, I did see pictures of it once, though, and, uh, it looks different to that thing you're carrying. You monitor something? It's new. Is new a good thing? Given the circumstances, I'd say new is our best bet. Pretty much. Do you know this Ati guy? <laughs> of course. He's my favorite coffee break buddy. Dude has got some crazy stories. And he probably knows more than anyone else around here. Okay, it makes sense so he knows saying. people around here. Any idea where he's from? I'm guessing Sweden. Uh, he's from where he's from. Like, there are just some stones that are better left unturned, you know? Mm. I should be going. Try to stay Press. alive. You got a lot of time to lift. Tactical what they were doing. Alright, uh, he's playing the spot. That's it. The other sector should be open now. I 
think it's time I told Emily why I'm here. I'll risk it. internal lockdown. Let's talk, Emily. Yes. Listen, Emily. <sighs> Screw it. Just tell her. I haven't been completely honest. I have a younger brother, Dylan. When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in Ordinary's landfill. The slides created doorways to other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. You will find out eventually. But we found help. Through one of the doorways, we met something. A being. A being? What kind of being? It's hard to describe, but it... She helped us. We managed to turn the projector off. The bad things that came through the doorways... were gone. After that, your people came. Tried to grab us. I ran away. They got Dylan. I left him behind. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. He covered it up. No one believed me. I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to the slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I've never heard of it, but around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. A large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. And the case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since Ordinary. In my head. She led me to you. I call her... Polaris. Polaris? As in, a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the Hiss? If she got you in here, in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. Which may help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. Now, cross-referencing them to the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes. But one was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. Is that Dylan? The other match is on something called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron Resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attacked. So, Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. Pretty much. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my keycard. The sector elevator will take you there. Hmm. 
Marshall is the next step. What Emily told me about ordinary, my powers being connected to things in the Bureau's past, I am so close to something. Do you feel it? Something's coming. What's coming? We take turns to come for a visit. I helped you. You owe me now. And when time comes, I will come calling. Alright, this is going to be the end of this gameplay. Um, pretty much um, doing director shit the director does um just the wizard of power plant um um cool down the pumps what else um cool down the pumps and um reactivating the conveyors so the building won't blow up pretty much a, yeah pretty much clean it up so everything so we get everything clear but at the end we get up talking to Emily um, we get a little bit more insight of Jesse's past saying that it was some type of her town was let's say her town had uh, doorways to get to places and what in a doorway and came out with a beam but she can't describe so the FBC came in she ran away they took her younger brother dylan and the people that was involved in that case was trent and darling as you know trent is trent is gone and darling is still out there we just only thing we see darling is in is in um is on the tv so i hope we find darling and um in the meantime and um and along throughout this game um, but we gotta um, get in contact with uh, what was that Marshall? That's in a research uh, facility, so we don't get into that. But we we'll leave it right here. If you enjoy this gameplay, hit the like button, uh, subscribe if you're new, comment down below what you think about this gameplay, and we're gonna be out, bro. Peace. Thank you.